Hi everyone. So we are on our way to Target. Um, I need to pick up some groceries. Um, I also have been kind of inspired. Um, I ordered, I can't remember. I should probably watch like yesterday's vlog to see what I said then because I can't remember. Oh, this hair is driving me nuts. I like straightened half of it yesterday and it's a hot mess. Anyway, um, so I've been kind of inspired like I was looking up about the planners and stuff and I kind of did a little bit of research because while it's not like super expensive, it's kind of expensive to me. But as I started researching that, I found um, like all these different links to art journaling and I am not like, I love painting, um, love painting. And I really do like art stuff. However, I am just not like really good at it. Like my mom is an amazing artist, like amazing. And she can look at something and just draw it and it will look identical. Like she's done portraits for a lot of people. Um, oh my gosh, it just amazes me. And she's had this talent since she was a little girl like she's like seven years old and actually um, she has one of her drawings she did I think she's about eight and she like drew out her family and like what her kids would look like and I wish wish I had it we lived in the same city and I could show y'all because it is amazing the talent she had at such a young age that is just like true talent I don't really have that talent <laughs> um, at all but I am like I have more of like a vision like I wish I could draw like that um, because like I think of things that I wish I could draw but I just I'm sure if I took classes and kind of trained myself a little bit I could um, <clears throat> and maybe one day in the future I might do that I don't know but I do want to start doing kind of art journaling stuff um, because I have been feeling very like I kind of need like a hobby I guess I don't know I feel like it's just a really good way of expressing yourself and that's another thing is I think I can't remember I see I just can't remember what I talk about any like in an hour I won't remember what I've said in this video but I can't I have like a lot of anger issues not necessarily issues but like I get when I'm tired and frustrated it is just like and hungry which I'm hungry like all the time pretty much because I have also come to the realization that with, through my weight loss and everything I really am like addicted to food or like that would be my addiction if I were to have one and it's kind of like you know they always say it's like such a cliche saying like if you're an alcoholic you can stop drinking if you are a drug user you know you don't have to live you know you don't do heroin to stay alive every day whereas you have to eat to stay alive so that's what kind of makes it challenging sorry it's really hilly so I guess I've been like kind of looking for a new focus instead of you know like I kind of have the eating healthy thing down and my first year to two years of this new lifestyle was really teaching myself tools and I think that's something you always grow in but it's like I'm just sick of my life being about food and exercise all the time like you know that's also not healthy to a certain extent it's like there is more to life than just working out and eating healthy and so anyway I started looking up about this and why I need the a planner to be more organized um, because let me tell you I am frazzle brained can't remember anything I was like that before I had a baby and now that I have a baby it's just worse um, and I really want to become more organized and just like a more like I don't think I'm unreliable but I want to be that person that they're like wow you're really on top of it so mm -hmm, I'm working on it but when I like I said through the process I started looking up art journaling and it just really inspired me so I'm gonna look at journals at Target also because I know you can get like little blank ones really cheap and I don't know 
I've always loved office supplies. I'm like my dad's the same way. And I've always loved office supplies and nice pens. And I've been looking into getting like maybe a fountain pen or something. I don't know. So I just, I've always enjoyed being creative, but I get frustrated. Oh my gosh, why are you stopping to turn? Is that, does that irritate anyone else? Like you don't need to stop to turn. Like I'm in the middle of a busy street. <laughs> So anyway, I'm just like really inspired to try this and I'm probably gonna, it's probably gonna be really ugly, but it's more for me to write about. Like I said, when I get frustrated or I don't know, I, I feel really sad sometimes about how much winter is growing up and like how fast she's growing. I'm being one of those really annoying people driving through a parking lot, but there's like no one here, so it's okay. Um... But, yeah, it just, like, I don't know. It's kind of hard sometimes when she's growing so fast. And it makes me kind of sad. But then I'm happy that she's developing. I feel really fat today. Do you ever have those days where you're like, I just feel really fat? Um, I do. So, I'm going to go into Target right now. And I'm going to look at their journals and stuff. And um, I am going to start doing that. And I also saw... You know, I found a bunch of mini Polaroid pictures that I had. I had a mini Polaroid camera, gosh, probably 10, 12 years ago, and I don't know where it is, and they don't, I don't even think they sell film for that anymore, but I found a bunch of them, and that was kind of neat, and then I started looking online, and you can buy, like, a little Polaroid camera for, like, $50 or something, so uh, I'm, I'm not going to get one now because we have so much going on with, I am going to get the camera... Um, I'm buying a house and all of that like we have a lot of upcoming expenses but eventually I would like to do that I think that would be me I'd like to get it before my cousin gets here because I would love to art journal like their trip here and that'll be a lot of fun so and I would also I, I just was like I needed something to focus on other than like being a mom and losing weight you know like I just needed something that I could really, and like being a wife, obviously. So, I don't, I've talked for a long time. I don't know if that makes sense, but that's just kind of how I'm feeling. I'll show you what I get from Target, though, if I find anything good. <sighs> okay, so I got all the groceries in and put away, and I had to put my hair back because, girl, that heat is no joke. Winter is laying down. She's not, she's laying down, but she's not sleeping. So, I am officially calling this like as well like my friends and family will know I call it reflection time because I need to reflect and she needs to reflect I'm gonna show you what I'm reflecting on but also I get a lot of questions um, like on Instagram Facebook and like um, private message about my meals so I'll just show you what I've been having for lunch like probably for the past week or so and it's just really easy, simple, and I think it's yummy, so. Okay, so it's on my lap, and Tucker really wants some, um, but it's a slice, I do four slices of Swiss cheese, and then I do six slices of, like, um, smoked turkey, and then I get these little 100 calorie guacamole things, and I, like, kind of divide it into four, and I, like, spread it onto the four slices, and then I roll them up and eat them like a roll up and then that's like extra meat and Tucker really wants some but he doesn't get it. I eat all my calories. I don't share them. So yeah, quick easy lunch because I don't like to make meals most of the time during the day. Oh, today is a rough one. It's a rough one. It's a rough one. You got yogurt everywhere. You didn't even eat your yogurt. Yeah, I still love you, but today was rough. Oh, it's been a rough one. That's like all I can think of to say. I don't know what it is today. She is just not in a good mood. She doesn't want her yogurt, which is fine. The flavor sounds disgusting to me anyway. It's pear spinach mango it's okay it's not as bad as I thought it would be and it's just it was a really bad idea oh 
Go stop screaming now. So, um, I w it wasn't very smart of me to give her that. Um, she woke up screaming while I was eating. So, I went and got her. Um, oh, I might as well get this. So, I went and got her. And um, I thought, well, you know what? She probably does want a snack. So, I got her a snack. You want to get down? I got her a snack and it's like she just screamed. Just screamed. Kind of like this. Um, so, I think she's just, today our schedule has gotten all thrown off. Um, yeah. Oh. Oh, goodness. And Lawrence has to go by the um, office for the builder to sign some stuff um, for our house so he'll be home a little later which is I mean I'm glad that that's all getting taken care of but uh, today's a good day to start my creative journaling I haven't even made our bed that my friends is like so unlike me you want to get down because that's generally the first thing I do when I get up <laughs> not today not today okay let me get this little this little angel this little angel down so she can play look how cute you look today yeah you got little zebra shorts on and you got a pretty tank top with a bow look at you how cute hi winter hi, hi winter Say hi, Winter. Hi. Can you say hi? Can you wave hi? Wave hi. Oh, you got it. Oh, what a day. Can you just tell from the way I look that it has, like, just been one of those days. It has been a really tough day. And I got a bunch of mail. Um, like, I can't remember if I said we're getting new furniture when we move. We got a flyer for, like, one of those rooms to go places, and I have to check it out. Oh, look, I was just talking about this with one of my friends, Oriental Trading. She said there's, like, a bunch of just, like, overwhelming amount of stuff in here. I'll have to look at that. I got a catalog. Um, Lawrence took winter. He had a house appointment I think I said that earlier I, I mean like now and um, so he took winter because he I think he could tell I was going crazy I was it's been kind of a hard day here I said that like eight times like I can't even gather my thoughts um, which I need to do oh I need to take stuff out to defrost for dinner because a good man like that deserves a dinner okay what kind of dinner should we have though oh my gosh I can't I can't do it today um I'll defrost some chicken there is a dead fly in our freezer that is how bad the fly situation can be here Okay, well, this kitchen is a disaster zone, and I need to clean it and put some laundry on, and then I'm going to try and just take a break because my brain kind of hurts today. Okay, so I was making dinner, and I was chopping up some zucchini. Um, why? I can't even think. That is baking right now and I only have like one good knife and it's the only knife I ever use which is why when we move I'm gonna get rid of our block thing because I like never use the knives in there but as I was chopping and I'm shocked I've never done this before I took a chunk of my finger oh my gosh it's I don't want to gross you out too much um, I don't think I'm going to need stitch. I mean, I don't think they could even stitch that, but it keeps bleeding. I just noticed because I've been trying to put pressure on it and it really kind of hurts a lot. Um, 
see my bloody little tissue. But I have never really injured myself. Like, I've never had to get stitches or anything due to a injury. And I don't want to experience that. So, I'm not really eating because I kind of lost my appetite. And uh, Lawrence and Winter are having spaghetti. And I was going to have a salad with some zucchini, obviously. But, uh, yeah. Is that good spaghetti? Is it good? Are you going to share with... No, don't share with the kitty. They have their own food. Yeah, they have their own food, silly. Yeah, you drop your fork and... When you drop it, you kind of lose it. But... Winter seems to be in a little, mood, a little better of a mood. Not in a mood. She was in a mood. Um, she had a little nap. And Daddy came home. Ting! And that always makes her happy. And yeah. He went for a drive. Yeah, he took her for a drive. They had to go. I think I said, I don't even remember. Yeah. <laughs> they, he had to go sign something. Ting! Yay! For the paperwork um, on the house. So, that was good. I got my little break. I think I did vlog then. I don't even know. Eat your spaghetti. No, put your plate down. The plate stays down. Thank you. You got me? Where'd your finger go? Where'd your finger go? I can watch you do that all day. Oh, sleepy monkey. You are sleepy.